Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Donkey Kong Country. In the last part, we finished the final world and we're all and we started up against King K. Rule with the, no success. Um, I got him to about his third phase and I kept dying. Like I said, I'm trying to remember this and I'm doing this without sound, so it's more difficult than usual. At first, I didn't think sound was such a big problem when I started doing LPs, but it is. When you're used to hearing things, it becomes apparent that you need to hear. Especially since the sounds really help in this fight, because then you can hear him coming, you can hear when, when he's going to do stuff. So, don't blame me if I suck balls. Number one, I'm out of practice. Number two, I can't hear what's going on. Number three, Gay cock. Alright, so this part. See, I can remember in my head what to do, because me and my brother used to make the sound effects as the, the cannonballs were falling. I don't know, we were gay like that. <laughs> this is actually a really fun boss fight. It's probably the hardest boss fight in the game, which shouldn't be a surprise, I mean it's the last boss fight, so it should be the hardest one in the game, right? Uh, let's see if I can keep two Kongs for the credit roll thing. It'd be really great if I could. Probably not gonna happen, because now I jinx myself, but oh well. His crown gets faster every time he throws it, by the way. If you couldn't tell. I might do it this time, actually. Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Alright, folks. That is... The last boss of Donkey Kong Country. This game is done. Now all that's left is this stuff. Well done, Donkey, my boy. Who would have thought you're a young whippersnapper like you? Could have beaten that bunch of no-good crumblings. You've made an old man proud. Go and look in your your horn, and I think you'll be in for a surprise. <laughs> I'm old. If I had been playing, I'd have found everything. Love this. I'm sure there must be some bonus rooms you haven't found. Yes, and I'm not going to find them in this playthrough. <laughs> I'm not doing extra shit. Yay, the bananas are back! I actually never showed this cave at the start of the game, but because it was gonna take up time. Alright, here's the road call. Cast of characters. The bad guys first. This is actually a really long and nice ending. So, I pretty much enjoy it. I This game is fun. I love it to death. It, like I said, I might be a little biased because it was the first video game I ever owned. Uh, not to mention it came with the first game system I ever owned. But, it's it's. I think most people, when they think, most people from my generation, when they think Donkey Kong, they initially think Donkey Kong Country. Like, I know people from the 80s will think, uh, um, are gonna think Donkey Kong for, uh, for, um, uh, for the arcade, um, which, uh, if you didn't know, I'll just give you a little bit of information. Cranky Kong in this game is actually the original Donkey Kong from those games, according to the information given in the game. Uh, game guide and information that's been released by Nintendo and stuff. But... Most people I know who are my age, when they hear Donkey Kong, they think Donkey Kong Country. Some people think Donkey Kong 64, but like I said, uh, in an earlier part, that's considered a Donkey Kong Country game by most people. I definitely consider it one, even though I never played it. I want to get my hands on it, though. And I remember saying, like, saying, like, um, ever since the third one came out, like, years after the third one came out, like, it's a real shame there isn't more Donkey Kong Country games. 
And we got a new one. I knew they were eventually going to try and release another one to, to make money off of the series again. But, but I didn't... I didn't expect it in the form it was. I always assumed that Rare would make another one, but I lost hope in Donkey Kong Country when Rare was uh, what had um, become part of Microsoft because I knew that certain games wouldn't be coming out. Is it my turn yet? Donkey Kong. Candy Kong. Oh, yeah. Surely it's me next. Cranky Kong. Oh, good old Cranky. And Donkey Kong, of course. The star of our game, Donkey Kong. Yeah, I couldn't have done it without you either, buddy. I love this. I think it was great the animators gave us this. <laughs> it was funny as the graphics here were actually 3D. But Rare had got is actually pretty good at doing the 3D on Super Nintendo stuff. I actually think this entire game is pretty much done in Mode 7, but I can't be sure of that. I did this using one life, and it took less than an hour. Sure, uh, Cranky Kong, sure. So here's the actual credits, all the programmers and stuff. and. Like I said, a fantastic job Rare did with this. It's just a shame that they're not working, that they didn't make the new one. But it still looks like a really good game, so I'm not going to object. If I had it my way, though, I'd have them make another one, because then there'd be certain things like... I've The main complaints I hear about the new game is that it's... It relies too much on the, uh, on the Wiimote stuff, and that Diddy Kong isn't a playable character. Yeah, I don't like the whole Diddy Kong thing and the uh, the Wii stuff, like the like the motion sensor controls using the Wii mote. That's one of the reasons why I haven't finished uh, uh, New Super Mario Bros. Wii because I have the game and I love it, but I hate having to shake the controller all the time. Like, I don't know why game developers can't figure it out. It's it, it's a controller. Just give me use the buttons for stuff. Don't <laughs> make me do extra shit. Because if it's been a long day of work or a long day of school or something and I want to sit down and play a game, I don't want to be shaking the fucking controller. So, I mean, there's peripheral game. If I want to play a peripheral game, I'll play a peripheral game like Rock Band or something. I'm not going to play Shake the Control. Well, hopefully... It's not needed in the game. I don't know if it is needed, but we'll find out. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. That's my playthrough of Donkey Kong Country. Um, when we return, we're going to head on to Donkey Kong Country 2. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.